Hi, I'm Laura. And this is my journey on the Voice Kids Germany. Seeing that really brings up a lot of, of good memories because it was just such an amazing time. I didn't even notice that the audience was standing up or clapping a lot because I was so focused on what I was doing. So then one time I just looked down on the chairs and I saw them turned around. So I was like, what? <laughs> when did that happen? Right now my blind audition is at 213 million views, which is a number that you can't even comprehend anymore because I remember when it was at 8 million views and I was like, that's like the whole population of Austria saw my video. And then it just got up and up and then it, I just stopped, started losing the, the comprehension for this. I, I could not, I could not understand how that, that large number and also whenever I meet people or when there's still people texting me from Vietnam and Brazil and telling me, Hey, I just, I just found your Instagram account now and I love your blind audition. And I'm like, how is that still, how is that still going on? This is amazing. The big red chair was actually a little more uncomfortable than I imagined, but still very cool. Wie heißt du denn? Laura. Laura. Ja. Wie alt bist du? 13. 13 Jahre alt. Du weißt, das war der verbotene Song. Den darf man eigentlich nicht singen, weil er, weil er unsingbar ist. Und du hast ihn einfach sensationell gesungen. Es war unfassbar. Ich bin, also ich muss gerade kurz kurz sagen, ich bin sprachlos. Dankeschön. Warte doch. Nee. Nein. Also lass mich kurz, ich ähm, muss das kurz zu Ende führen. Nein. Was mich doch? Ja, also. Ähm, Bitte komm in mein Team. Warte. Du sollst meine Lehrerin sein. Wie kann aus dir sowas rauskommen? Wie ist das möglich? Dankeschön. Bitte bring mir das bei. Du kannst nehmen, wie du willst, ne? Honestly, I did not think about who I was going to choose before it actually happened. I never really thought about it that much because I didn't want to be disappointed in case nobody turned around. Ich glaube, wir Frauen müssen zusammenhalten. Drei Zuckerhasen habt ein ganz tolles Lied. Es ist eine sehr, sehr gefühlvolle Ballade und ich glaube, ihr könnt alle genau das zeigen, was ihr am besten könnt. Es ist von Kelly Clarkson, Because of You. 
cool. Ich bin auf jeden Fall froh, dass ich eine Ballade singe. Ich freue mich total. Wir haben eine ganz tolle Zeit zusammen. The, the week prior to the battles was even more fun than the week prior to the blind auditions because it was it really just felt like like three friends singing together and rehearsing together. The song is richtig schwer and besonders dann auch noch mit zwei Mädels die echt gut singen können, so einen Song zu singen, das ist schon richtig, richtig hart. We are also still friends, everyone, and also Lorin, um, I've met him 2010 already, so three years prior to The Voice Kids. And he was the one who told me that there is going to be a The Voice Kids. We're still very good friends, we just recorded a song three years ago and released the song together. His family is still very, very good with my family, so I really just made a, a, a lifelong friendship out of this. And also some other kids that I follow on Instagram and seeing what they do now is just very, very great to see how far they've come. Also die drei müssen gar nicht viel machen, damit es ihr Song wird, weil es ist schon ihr Song geworden. Richtig gut! Die singen das so toll, das ist alles so perfekt. Ich denke, jeder hat so seine Stärke, weil einfach jeder so ein gewisses Etwas hat, mit dem er auch überzeugen kann. on the stage with other people was completely new for me but also it was a lot of comfort to have people around you Yeah, I was a little scared because of the harmonies, because I've also never done harmonies before. But we had just a lot of practice and we could also always rely on each other when, you know, one of us just maybe wasn't sure where the harmonies are exactly. Because
I think the biggest thing I've learned is that um, making mistakes is not equal to it not being a good performance because there were some notes that I did not really hit right, but still it was for for a lot of people it was a very good performance. So I think that's that's definitely something I've learned that making mistakes is not is not necessarily does not necessarily lead to a bad performance. Ich gehe mit Laurin. So when they decided that Laurin is going to the next round, I instantly started crying. But I'm very thankful that they did not record me crying. So they just they just let us let let us go off the stage and left us alone for a bit until we we got it together again. But that was nice because I I I wouldn't want to be on TV crying. So Immediately after the voice kits, nothing really happened because I, I didn't really get recognized on the streets. I think that's happening now more than before because now a lot of people have watched my blind audition already and right when it came out, it wasn't such a big boom yet. Um, but yeah, I got, I got the chance to record three albums. I've had a lot of cool chances to be on TV shows in Austria and Germany on radio shows, on interviews. I also got to do a lot of charity projects, which is also a, also always something special for me. I um, did a lot for, uh, for cancer care for children, uh, for organizations in Austria. And yeah, so that's, that's great. And now I am going to university. I am studying. I don't really, I don't really do a lot of performances right now, of course, because of, because of COVID. And, um, but there is new music coming as soon as we're allowed in the studio again, there is new music coming. And if you want to hear the new music as soon as it's out, you can follow me on Instagram. It's Laura Kampuba Music. Thank you for watching my journey. Click here to see my favorite blind auditions on the best of the voice kids.